It's the end of another year and I learned so much by watching what you watched every year. Here are the top five roadshow videos based on your viewing of them. They tell us a lot about what's interesting out there from the expected to the not so much. Let's go. Number five is a tailgate. Yeah, it's on the back of a truck, but it's the tailgate. On the 19 GMC Sierra Denali, they packed so much innovation into the rear end of that thing, we couldn't get over it. Apparently, neither could you. The Multi-Pro tailgate is a freaking Swiss Army knife. It has six different functions, including a backstop for longer cargo, a fold-down mode to let you get closer to the bed for easier loading, a swing-down step, and an inner tailgate for enhanced second-tier loading. Plus, there's even a fold-down workstation mode. There's more tech in the back end of that thing than in an entire Fiat 500. Number four is the Ford Edge stalking Nissan Murano eating resurrected Chevy Blazer for 2019. Yeah, it fits in the shadow of a classic K5 Blazer, but that's what we need these days. It apparently spoke to you quite a bit, and it said to Ford, your move. Number three, the Acades Opposed Piston Engine. I think a lot of you were intrigued by this because it seems well baked and thought out. Because the idea of an opposed piston engine isn't exactly new, it's the execution that looks really promising. And this guy's about as different from other combustion engines as an EV is. But it stays in the lane that we know. Fuel in, combustion, power out. Number two was the almost unbelievable now, unbelievable, Goodyear Oxygen concept tire. They really stretched for this one. The idea would be to have living moss in the center to do what plants do, take pollutants out of the air and exude oxygen. At the same time, they hack into the plant to get electricity from its photosynthesis. That's apparently real. And then use that to power connectivity and light signaling functions. I kid you not, you just have to see the video. Your number one favorite video on Roadshow this year was a $70,000 station wagon with a weird English name, crappy cabin tech, and a tepid 3.5 out of 5 rating. What's going on here? It's just plain tasty. The Jaguar XF Sport Brake, only available in a supercharged trim, just said, hey, here's something different. I'm not a crossover. And it's sexy in a way that Mercedes wagons can't even comprehend. Yes, I want one, as long as they can put wood grain on it. 